Everything we do is focused on having the maximum impact in helping people. It's the Rogers Charity Classic, the 2024 version here at Canyon Meadows Golf and Country Club. Behind me is the first hole, a spectacular backdrop for one of the largest golf charity events in Canada, helping out over 273 youth-based Alberta groups. Why not give back as much as you possibly can? And, and, and the players get it. That's why they're here. They'll tell you. They understand what, what's happening here. And, and we're very fortunate to be the most charitable event on the, on the PGA Tour champions and rival most events on the regular tour. I think that's the... The vision that obviously Mr. Riddell Clay obviously had visioned because when we first sat down and had the meetings as a patrons group, his, his goal was actually 10 million a year trying to raise and look at what we've surpassed. The 78 pros also had a chance to dust off their clubs before Friday's Players Championship event for the Pro-Am as amateurs joined them in a round of golf most in awe. It's, it's amazing how he reads the, the greens, how he uh, plans each shot. It's, uh, it's, it's uh, something to see. Thankfully, we're doing a shamble, so, you know, it makes up for a few of the sins we're committing out there, but no, it's been fantastic. After Thursday's Pro-Am, the Players' Championship begins with the pros teeing off for a $2.4 million U.S. purse. Players are loving it. They're having a great time. It's one of the best fields we've had ever, so um, all the stars are here. Obviously, we've got Mike Weir and Stephen Ames vying for the title, so it's, uh, it's going to be an exciting week, and the weather looks pretty good overall. Conditions of the golf course this year, again, are fa fabulous. I think overall it's just a matter of being a little bit more patient than I have been in the past, and uh, we'll go from there. And here's another one, too, that $10 for every ticket that's sold will be in support of the Alberta wildfire evacuees. Note, Rogers is the parent company of City News. In Calgary, Phoenix Phillips, City News.